Every day the sap runs, the Cabanosuk is busy. We're going to taste it to get an idea of how far along it is. I don't think it's very advanced yet, not even half boiled. Maple sugar water was processed into syrup long before Europeans arrived in North America. Many First Nations cuisines use maple sugar or syrup instead of salt. Quebec is the world's largest producer of maple syrup with about 75% of global production. The ultimate test. That's it. It's not very far along. It gives me a good idea. It will be ready by the end of the afternoon. Uh, yeah, it's coming, it's coming, sorry. There's gonna be a good sap one. We're gonna do a stage for sap. And now for the first filter, the one with the bigger holes. Oh, you have different sizes? It's so that the filter with the small holes doesn't clog. The gold of the forest. This is going to be very rich and nourishing. Pure sap. It's going to be very nutritious. On n'a jamais regardé notre affaire, hein? À dread dread dessus. Et il est parfait? Oui. Regarde. Look, do you see the red mark on that instrument? Non. It's right on the mark. That's the density meter. It's a thermometer and a density meter. With the heat, the density changes. With the atmosphere pressure too, everything adjusts. We say a high pressure, low pressure. The boiling point of the water changes with the pressure. That's the reason that there is a density meter with a thermometer. It's like butter at this point. It takes about 40 gallons of sugar water to make one gallon of maple syrup. The maple sugar season draws to a close when the cycle of thawing and freezing stops. The syrup gets darker and there is less of it. It is the frogs, though, that announce the true end of the season. 
Ou qui savent. 1000 au galon. 1000 au galon, c'est généreux en quelque